Hey yo together and very welcome to a new let's play XCOM Enemy Unknown Yep, that's true and that's a game I want to play for a long time because I think it is awesome it can be quite challenging and yeah I will play this game now and there is an add-on for this as well and I will play that after as well I think so let's let's see uh, let's enable I uh, tutorial so that we all know what this game is about and how to play it shouldn't take too long okay then we will have one single save Yeah, okay, let's just try that. It's it's a normal mode. Uh, I saw some, some replays, no, no, some VODs from other guys playing this game on Twitch. So I know a little bit about this game. Uh, should be fun. I remain for the challenge, but I will stick to normal mode. And I think if I, if I got that one done, then I think I will have the add-on on classic mode. Impossible, I was told this horrific you should never click impossible if you want to have fun at this game so yeah let's play classic and I guess I guess in the second wave no let's let's keep that like this okay challenging but fair that that sounds good for me okay so let's start <laughs> yeah, that might be true. Uh oh. Uh oh. That doesn't look good. Oh well. Ugh. Hello, Commander. In light of the recent extraterrestrial incursion, this Council of Nations has convened to approve the activation of the XCOM project. You have been chosen to lead this initiative to oversee our first and last line of defense. Your efforts will have considerable influence on this planet's future. We urge you to keep that in mind as you proceed. Well, thanks. Oh well, okay, okay. That was the last transmission, sir. Patch me through to Voodoo 3 1. Hmm. You were being deployed to Germany. At 1900 hour Zulu, several unidentified objects fell to Earth. After ruling out the possibility of a downed satellite, we now believe these objects to be extraterrestrial in nature. Shortly after impact, 
German officials received reports of mass hysteria and freak weather around one of the impact zones. Then things went dark. At 2100 hours, a chopper carrying a German military recon team went down in the area after they reported being fired upon. As you know, Germany is a member of the Council, and they have requested our assistance. Our mission is to assess the situation on the ground, ascertain the current status of the German recon team, and investigate the extraterrestrial objects. Central out. Okay, so let's see. Assess situation at impact site, locate German recon team, and investigate extraterrestrial objects. Okay. Always move to flank enemies if possible. They are easier to hit and to secure critical hits against. Okay, launch mission. So let's see. Central, this is Big Sky. Looks like we found the crash site. Roger, Voodoo 3 1. Any sign of activity? Negative. Nothing's moving down there. Hmm. Okay. Set her down nearby. Dropship has arrived. Central. You getting all this? Copy that, Delta Squad. First things first. Let's get you out of the open and into cover. Whatever did this could still be out there. Delta One, take point. Take cover behind that debris directly in front of you. Okay. Use the mouse to select a highlighted position and move to... And to move the soldier. Ah, right click, okay. Sounds good to me. Unit flag. Okay, got it. Now advance to the vehicle nearby. Delta 2, your turn. Move up to the debris. That thing isn't going to offer you much cover, but it's better than nothing. There's full cover straight ahead. Advance to that position. Okay. Full cover three. seems good. Move to that vehicle dead ahead. Okay. Central, I have movement. 30 meters north of my position. Police vehicle. Roger. Proceed to the next vehicle for a better vantage point. Okay. Delta 4, go check it out. It's a long way from your position, and there's no available cover between here and there, so you better double time it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Holy hell. What do you see, Delta 4? Report. Ugh. Looks like one of the recon teams, sir. It looks like something. Is that your man, Delta 4? Negative, sir. That's someone else. Dr. Valen, what's he saying? He is saying, help me. That radio transmission is coming from somewhere north of the squad's current position. Based on its strength, probably from inside a structure. Uh oh. Thank you, Doctor. Delta, advance and infiltrate that building. And remember, stay in cover. Once also make cover long distances by dashing. This will consume both moves and end the soldier's turn. Okay. So let's see. Oh! Okay. Go, go, go! And now. Okay, we go there. Central, I got a lot of blood here. Roger. See where it's coming from. Central, I think I just found another one of the recon team. Or what's left of him. But this doesn't make sense. Looks like he's been dead for a week. Even more perplexing is the cause of death. It appears that he was eviscerated when something burst out of him from the inside. Sir, I have visual on the object. Permission to approach. It's the only cover between you and that building. Permission granted. Oh man, that's quite risky, isn't it? Well, here we go. Talk to me, soldier. What is it? 
I got no idea what this thing is, but I can confirm that it's no satellite. Roger. All right, Delta Squad. We're almost to the building. Keep moving. Okay. Okay, people. Now let's get inside. Delta One, there's a window in front of you. Let's take a look. Oh, man. In position. Looks clear. Uh-huh. Okay. Copy that. Get in there and get to cover. Uh, I would have full cover here, but I'm not allowed to go there, which is stupid, but okay. Just a tutorial. Delta 2. That door's in our way. Take it down. Uh, okay. Solid copy. Yeah, sure. Dump it. <laughs> so let's see. Ah. Central, we have eyes on the target. He's armed. Uh oh. Copy Delta Three. Okay, everyone, get into position nearby, but do not approach. That's mm. risky. Doctor, see if you can communicate with him. Tell him to drop his weapon. I will try. Hello. Können Sie mich hören? Wir sind hier, um Ihnen zu helfen. Bitte lassen Sie Ihre Waffen fallen. Ha! That German! <laughs> nice! <laughs> nice! Keep your eyes open, people. I don't nice. like the looks of this. <laughs> that was so cool. Man, this guy got a grenade. You need to be careful here. Oh, man. Yeah, sure. Rambo style. So, and remember, okay, it's still the tutorial, so everything should be fine, I guess, because we can't do anything wrong here, I guess. No. Uh, but yeah, remember, we only got one save point, so any action we do will be saved immediately, I guess, so there's no point of return. So that means that I have normally to think twice or maybe five times before I do anything. Uh oh. Okay, dashing there. Delta 3. Move in and disarm him. Carefully. Carefully. And he's running. Yes. Oh no. 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 Oh! Okay. What the hell is you going on? Delta three is down! Delta three is down. Oh my god, one guy is dead. Uh oh. Yeah, headshot! He's down. Delta one is down! I didn't lead this operation at all. I'm Central. not guilty here. Oh my goodness. This guy's got me pinned down, taking heavy fire. Damn it. Delta 2, your flank 2. Find some better cover. Okay, okay. All right, Delta 2. Weapons free. Get ready to fire. Ah, okay, yeah. Oh yeah, nice, okay. We got that one down. Nice shot. Delta 4, you're freed up to move. Get out of there and get into cover. Okay. Now toss your grenade at the enemy in front of you. Toss a grenade, all right. Frag grenade. Can we? Yeah, okay, should be. Okay. There you go. Grenades out. Nice. Now get ready for their counterattack. Counterattack. 
What the? There's another one coming in behind. Oh no. Yeah, Damn bye. It. It's just you now, Delta 2. Let's tip the odds in our favor. Look around for a position where you can flank the enemy. Okay, Q or E to Okay. All right. I got a feeling for this. It. You have a clear shot from that position. Fire. Well, a grenade would be more safe. 75% to hit. Okay. Ah, we got it. Not bad. Not bad at all. Now we need to go away or we need to evacuate, I think. Central. I think that's it. It's over. Are you sure? Roger that, Delta. Secure the bodies and head back to the Sky Ranger for immediate extraction. Extraction. Creepy. Very creepy. Gives me shivers. So let's see. Uh, identify base location. Your laboratories and workshops cost 50% less. Weapons cost less to build and maintain. I go to Europe. I would love to go to uh, autopsies, Africa. Africa sounds cool. Asia. Well, let's go to Europe then. Affirmative. We are coming home. There we are! Looking good, I would say. <laughs> we lost three men! Two men, one woman. Yeah, you, you get it. Three soldiers. Oh man. What kind of screens what are they using? Are they? Whatever they are, they nearly took out a squad of our best soldiers. If you'll excuse me, doctors, the commander is waiting in mission control. Their technology is far beyond ours. Mm. Then I'd say our work is cut out for us, Doctor. Welcome to XCOM HQ, Commander. I'm Central Officer Bradford. My role in this project is twofold. Providing tactical support for our field operations and keeping you briefed on the current situation. Okay. My efforts should allow you to focus on the bigger issues at hand. Okay. Speaking of which, we have a soldier waiting for a promotion in the barracks. I'll let you get to it. Ooh. Okay, so that seems to be our base. Commander to the barracks. Commander to the barracks. Commander to the barracks. That's the barracks. Okay. Commander, the soldier is waiting for you in the armory, which is located there in the barracks. Oh, cool. They got a pool tish there, billiard pool, however it's called, they can train. Few soldiers. Okay. Only one recruit from Delta Squad made it back alive from our last mission, Commander. And I'd say a promotion is in order. You know what? This guy will be you, Connor. <laughs> Uh, no, wait, wait, wait. Let's make your first Captain Connor. I've got it written down. And then you get your promotion. So, that's that. Orders confirmed. Yes, commander. Out. Oh, that's looking okay. Uh, so let's. No, wait. You just get. Oh my goodness, no. Ugh. Not looking too... Oh, well, wait. Okay, let's let's first get uh, yellow. That looks like yellow. Seven? Let's check if there's any other yellow color. Ooh, or 16. Seven or 16. Huh. This is kind of yellow. That's more like orange. <laughs> Gay! No. <laughs> okay, I, I get you the, the seven first. And if you're... Wait, let's see. Seven or... I guess 16 looks looks better, I guess. So let's, let's keep 16. Oh, that looks not too bad, I would say. Okay. Uh, let's get you our... Helmet as well. I 
It looks quite badass, but let's see. For a heavy soldier, because you're heavy, so that means quite badass. Uh, what's that? Okay, uh, I think I get you that one. If you want to have another one, just write it down in the comments. I can change it. But for now... Uh, Okay, you get this one now. If you want to have another one, you can go through the uh, through the video and then choose it and just write it down. I can change it whenever you want. Okay. As you know, Commander, every soldier is different. This particular soldier has shown an aptitude for heavy weapons. As he gains additional combat experience, we should continue his training along these lines. Yeah. And you got a fire rocket. This nice. soldier will now carry a rocket launcher in addition to his standard weapon. The aliens won't know what hit him. True, true. So that looks quite good, I would say. Oh, Dr. Valen asked to see you in the research labs, Commander. It sounded important. Yeah, we will check that. Commander to the research labs. Commander to the research labs. Okay. Hello, Commander. My name is Dr. Valen. I oversee the research labs. This is where all of XCOM's research and development takes place. Okay. We have already begun analyzing the artifacts recovered from our first encounter with the aliens. Based on our preliminary findings, we believe we can use them to develop some new equipment for our soldiers. Oh, that sounds good. With your approval, we will begin research immediately. You get my approval, and you can start immediately. So, let's see. Um... Weapon fragment xenobiology. It is crucial that we gain a thorough, thorough understanding of the physiology. Oh, I don't have enough skeptic corpses. Okay. Alien materials. Appear to be used materials that are lighter and stronger than anything we've seen. A cursory examination is already given us ideas for a way to improve the soldier's current body. Armor, but more research is required. It takes eight days. And this one takes eight days as well. Uh, let's start with the weapons fragments, I guess. Weapons are awesome. Um, no, wait, I need to make sure that you guys all live longer. Sure, damage is nice, but let's let's go a bit safer. Thank you, Commander. This research will take some time. We will notify you once it is complete. Okay. Thank you very much. Oh, no. It sounds like you are needed elsewhere. Yeah. Farewell, Commander. If you recover any additional artifacts during your field operations, I would be quite eager to study them. Of course. Commander I see. to mission control. Okay. Commander to mission control. Mission control is down there. Select mission control. I guess I can do that. The enemy is testing our capabilities, Commander. We've gotten reports of simultaneous attacks in two different countries. Oh no. We can only respond to one. The country we help will donate mm. more resources to our cause. But the panic level of the country we choose not to help will rise. It's not an easy decision, Commander. But it's one you'll have to make. Yeah, I see. Few adduction sites. Scientists or money. So I guess for now I go for money. I've read in a tutorial, in a guide, a short guide, that you should always go for engineers and money. And scientists come with time, you don't need too many of them. But yeah, let's let's go with money. Money is good. Money, I like money. Let's help China. Understood. The troops are waiting for you in the hangar. Hangar, okay. We go Commander, to the hangar. Before deploying our squad, you can choose which soldiers to send out there. Okay. I've taken the liberty of calling up our veteran. His combat experience makes him invaluable on the battlefield. Yeah, I see. So we've got quite some guys. Let's just launch the missions. I, I won't change recruits because they are most likely to die, they don't have any experience. If I would customize them now, that would be bad, but as soon as you go get to the veteran status, then you get it. Okay. Let's just launch the mission. I don't have any other weapons yet as well, or armor, or grenades or anything, so just started alien abductions. And let's try to get this done. Yeah, we got it. We're heading into China for the next operation. Alright. 
We've picked up a local broadcast indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan area. We should get down there and eliminate any hostiles. Okay. Gaining a height advantage over an enemy increases your chance to hit them. Okay. Sweep the abduction site and identify threats. Neutralize all hostile targets. We should get that, I guess. Should should be possible to do that. Ah. Three, two, one. Dropship has arrived. So our marines are out. And Hold we got on, soldier. One more. Before order. you move out, let's see what's inside that building. Your squad mate is closer, so let him check it out. Yeah, I'm still in the tutorial as it looks like. So use left shift and tab to change the console to select that you can. You want to select. Okay, yeah, I've done that already. Good. Now open the door. Quietly, so you don't reveal your position to the enemy. Okay. Now take cover inside. Alright. Now I want a man on the roof of that building. See if you can find a way up there, soldier. Okay. You can change the evaluations, elevations by pressing mouse up and mouse down or use that one. Okay, dash forward. Go, 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 Captain Connor. I don't want you to there die. Oh, oh. The rest of you, advance toward the enemy and get into cover. Hold your fire until I give the word. Okay, they, they saw us, right? Uh, oh, now I'm free to go wherever I want. Um, you are... Wait, this is looking quite grim. You're... Uh, this guy... Is uh, okay. One of you is going to the toilet stuff, and I hope you are in cover there. Yeah, looks good. And you're going into that building as well. I think that should be fine. So, what are they doing? Oh, they're shooting. Oh, they, they killed the cover. That's not good. What? I don't want to do that. You know what? Select this enemy. Oh, I have to. Yeah, okay. Oh, good shoot. Good, good, good shoot. Shot there, but... Uh, so just chance it. Yeah, the problem is you don't have any. Okay, let's just open the door. We don't have any cover there. That's a problem. Okay, time for the recruits to show what they are capable of. So first of all, can harm your team as well as the enemies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I want to destroy the cover, but. Let's see. Okay, screw it. Screw it. I don't know what's with the legs. The commander will be assuming command now as you sweep the rest of the area. As always, I'll be offering tactical advice as needed. And remember, your armor can only withstand a couple of shots from their weapons. So keep your eyes open and your heads down. Good luck. Yeah, I got it. Okay. So, you're going into full cover as well. And then... Oh yeah, let's try Overwatch. Fire on the first enemy that moves within your line of sight at a small aim penalty. Yeah, I guess it looks fine. Let's do Overwatch then. And this guy got full cover there, I guess. At the sign and Overwatch as well. Alright. So Connor, you... Oh. Oh yeah, that's also very important. Things can explode, uh, like uh, vehicles, uh, tanks, for example, anything. So you need to be careful, very carefully. So let's go there, Overwatch. So this one has no grenade left. The dashing is very risky. So let's let's see. Connor gets down there. Oh yeah, and also, what you can see, 
Uh, I need to reload this weapon, so let's let's do that. Reload. Okay. And since there was an explosion already, it's very unlikely to explode again. So let's dash into full cover there. Okay. And you're still overwatching this whole uh, location. Alright. So you need to use your brain to survive in this game, which is what I really like. And also it's not super fast paced like StarCraft 2. It is still very exciting to play because yeah, it's difficult. So you're going there first. I'm going really slowly forward because as I as I have seen from other guys playing this game, you can die so fast in this game. So that was very risky, but I think it was a uh, good move overall and you're dashing there and then let's see okay so no more fire at that location Connor you stay there um, ooh okay there are two enemies Okay, they are inside that building. Uh, you guys are going there. Overwatch, very important. And you can go to... Uh, it's very risky. No, uh, oops. That is no full cover. So you go there. Overwatch. And I guess you can... Ah, it's very risky. No, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna rush there. What's it's called? Sprint or rush? I'm not sure. I will check soon. Okay, they're still inside this building. Okay, I have no freaking idea. Ooh. Okay, this this guy gained some life, and it's shooting. Like we learned on our last mission, people. These things have highly advanced weapons. Wow, our recruit was killed. Our veteran's rocket launcher should make easy work of the structure the aliens are using for cover. And if we're lucky, it'll take out the aliens along with it. That is, if it hits. Oh man. Okay, so let's try it. Short as Let's just try it. That was so unlucky. I mean, I was in full cover. And he still hit. There you go. Good work out there, Strike One. If I may, Commander, the labs are on high alert. Teams are standing by for your orders. We can begin researching the newly recovered artifacts immediately. Yeah, let's see. We lost one guy there. But luckily not you, Connor. Luckily it wasn't you. Whew. Alright, so let's see. 